Hi, my name is uh, Tsenko Stefanov and I'm a solution manager with SAP. In this demo, I will show you the integration between CRM Opportunity Management and uh, Streamwork. I will log in into the CRM system as a sales representative called Perry Johnson. Upon logon, Perry will land on the homepage that contains a dedicated tray. It shows all the updates from Streamwork related to Perry. This way, he can immediately see what's going on in Streamwork. The updates, as we'll demo shortly, might be related to the CRM business transactions and activities Perry is involved in. In our example, Perry and his sales team are trying to sell some hardware to a company called Adcom. Perry and his team already have accounts with Streamwork and they have been using it successfully to collaborate. So let's open the opportunity with Adcom and see how Streamwork can help Perry and his team to win this deal. From within the opportunity, Perry can create a Streamwork activity. Not only that Perry can uh, decide on the activity's title and description, but uh, Perry can also choose the tools available in this uh, activity by selecting the right template. We have created some uh, CRM specific templates that uh, will allow Perry to upload the opportunity details into Streamwork. In addition, Perry can invite uh, the members of the sales team working on this opportunity. Moreover, Perry can choose to upload some of the attachments available within this opportunity. Once done, Perry will click the Save and Launch button and the activity will be created in Streamwork and started in a separate window. As you can see, the opportunity details have been posted to the activity and can be referenced by any of its participants. The attachment that we selected from the opportunity is also here. In addition, you can see some of the great decision supporting tools that Streamwork provides. Once done, Perry can go back to the opportunity. Let's take a look at the opportunity overview page. It contains two assignment blocks dedicated to Streamwork. The first one shows all the activities that have been created for the current opportunity. As you can see, one can have several activities per opportunity, each one supporting a particular uh, milestone, let's say. From this assignment block, one can post general comments to an activity or synchronize the data or simply close an existing activity. The second assignment block shows all the updates related to these activities. Unlike the tray on the home page, here you see only the updates related to the current op opportunity. Perry and his sales team soon realize that they do not have enough technical knowledge to win this deal. They need an IT resource to help them with the customer's needs. Fortunately, Perry knows a third-party consultant who has proven valuable on several similar projects. So Perry announces to all the participants in the activity that who invite that resource. He does so directly from CRM. Later at home, Perry logs into Streamwork and sees that Jane is uh, fine with his proposal. Perry invites the resource who happens to be a third-party consultant and uh, is uh, available through his uh, Gmail account. The consultant receives the invitation in his Gmail inbox. He clicks on the invite link and uh, logs in into Streamwork using his Gmail credentials. He doesn't have to waste time to create an account. After accepting the invitation, the consultant can start contributing to the decision-making process. Please note that he doesn't have access to the opportunity details, which is normal. He is a third-party resource and is not authorized. The next day, Perry logs into CRM and finds out that the consultant has accepted his invitation and is working on the technical details. Now Perry, his team and the technical expert Nick can work together towards closing this deal. 
This concludes the demo. I hope you enjoyed it.